We are back with another edition of The Vault, and I am so excited about this one because it has everything to do with home decor. We're at a really cool shopping stop called Real Deals in Rochester, Minnesota. They have everything from home decor that we're gonna be talking about, also jewelry, they've got fabulous clothing, so it certainly should be on your list of things to do when you're making a visit to the Med City. So talking about home decor, one of the things that I think is really important in decorating your home is to always have glass, something glass or mirror or a combination of both in each of your spaces. What it does is it creates a really cool energy and kind of a vibrancy that maybe you don't realize, but when folks walk in, you just feel the reflection and the energy and the excitement. Something else I think is really important is always have some form of greenery. What that does is that breathes life and energy into your space. So in the summer you can use plants, even if they're faux plants, or we like to call them permanent plants as opposed to fake. You can use chartreuse, beautiful, that beautiful bright kind of lime green in the summer or in the sp early spring. Is in the fall you head towards the warmer colors and in the winter of course you can use pine, spruce tips, or a combination of both. And something else I think is really cool is when you have a really big space and you're left scratching your head, what am I gonna do with that big space? Well, if it's across from a window or natural light or you have a beautiful view, put a big mirror there because what it does is it just echoes that energy and that light and that reflection. Again, creating kind of an exciting space. But something else you might not think about is a clock. You're seeing so many of these and what you've got back here are every size, shape and style for any type of decor that you have in your home. Nice and big, it fills up the space, so go for it, give it a shot. And when it comes to home decor, when you have a sofa, a lot of people will traditionally use a coffee table. But something that's on trend right now is instead of a coffee table, using an ottoman. But then you think, where am I gonna put my beverages? Where am I gonna put my popcorn? Well, one of the things that you can do is incorporate, like I like to do, is a tray. So what we've got here is a perfect idea of what you would wanna put on your ottoman. It's a tray, again, so many styles here at Real Deals. We chose this one, a little bit rustic. And what I like to do, again, is have the reflection. You could put a candle in here, you could put sand, you could put seashells. And then these decorative balls are really a cool accent piece. We've got different styles that you can use just by walking through. Don't hesitate to go with maybe a suckling instead or here's a cluster of sucklings. There's so many options of things that you can use. Now you've got your reflection, put in a bright pink candle and here we have a fabulous spring or summer bouquet. But don't hesitate when it comes time for fall or winter, take out those flowers, bring in something else that has a little bit more of a fall feel to it and then Get creative with this. Maybe you wanna put a cool black candle in here and let's grab some pine cones. That's kind of a little bit of an introduction to fall. So you've got a decorative tray, but when you have company, guests, or you're sitting down for your favorite sporting event or movie, take this off, set it off to the side, and voila, you've got a tray for all of your beverages and that popcorn. So essentially, personal touches make your house a home. And once you've made probably one of the biggest investments in your life, why wouldn't you want to put a little extra effort into it? And if you get stuck with some decorating ideas, you can always pop into Real Deals here in Rochester, Minnesota, and they'd be more than happy to help.